That's those custom Model 3 rims right there, too. Looking real good. Folks, sitting in my car right now, we're about to start the reveal video. If you guys have no idea what I'm talking about, watch last vlog. It's going to be linked in the description box below. I probably found the best haul of my dumpster diving career. I don't know if I've... I mean, this is crazy value. Let's go ahead and jump right into it. And if you want to see me actually find some items the night of, watch last vlog. It's going to be a lot of action. A lot of revealing. Let's go. Oh yeah, we got some coffee running in the books right now. But before my wife does stash these bad boys away, this, my friends, is just two of the clutch purses that are in the major, major stack. We got a Gucci, of course. Everyone knows the Gucci. Already looked inside. We have serial numbers. It's full-blown legitimate. Kate Spade, not worth as much, but still nice. These ones we're going to bless my missus, that's what that's the whole point, baby. You know what I'm saying? To keep, sell, and give away. And we're gonna give a couple away. Well, actually, technically that's keeping because it's kind of like what's mine is hers, etc. Anyway, we priced this one out last night. This one was selling used on multiple sites, eBay and a couple of other sites for about 200 used. Very, very nice. Kate Spade, not really no. I don't really know how much exactly that one is worth, but anyway, very, very nice. Great scores. That's just a little bit of the icing on the cake. Oh, and by the way, ladies and gentlemen, I sold the Canon XT digital DSLR camera we found in that big luxury purse haul. I will be keeping a tally after eBay fees and shipping. It's going to take a little bit of work, but we're going to give you a tally. I'm going to try to get most of that stuff up next week, and then we'll probably... It's going to take a few weeks to probably sell it. I'm going to price it really good, but we're going to give you a tally and see what the total haul was after I sold it all. This one was full of clothes. All right, we're going to split this up, but we got some riding gear, mountain bike gear here, some sleeves. We got some gel shorts here for riding or cycling. It doesn't matter. Looks like it was a mountain biker, though, for sure. We got, again, two gel. Those are just shorts. We got a cowl sweatshirt here. Absolutely fantastic. These are things I'm going to be washing and keeping for sure. Iron thighs front jersey again zip up jersey for cycling mountain biking whatever you prefer and we have another one as well by performance bicycles right there performance bicycles so two jerseys two gel shorts uh knee pad unfortunately wasn't able to grab the second one that was my bad but it's all good we got one there we got some nike shorts here okay folks i'm gonna be telling you things as i list them because there's just too much and i don't want it to be one long like 15 minute hey here's what i found in the biggest haul of the lifetime anyway a blue Burberry scarf cashmere. Absolutely fantastic. Just actually found that out. Felt like wool for some oddball reason. I guess I'm not an expert, but flipped it over and Burberry London 100% cashmere right there. It smells fine, looks clean, says dry clean only. We're not going to worry about it. We're going to pop it up on eBay. And then we have this, ladies and gentlemen, is probably, it, it might be the top, the, the tips of the tops. Again, this was in a garment bag. We took it out of the garment bag. Probably should have took the garment bag as well, but we have a spare one that we can sell it with. But the website, these are tags from the website. It's a consignment luxury, so you know this is legit. It's called therealreal.com, okay? They priced it on their website. Ladies and gentlemen, the brand is called The Row, and they priced it seven hundred and twenty five dollars the row brand leather jacket but it's not just any leather jacket ladies and gentlemen i looked at it already and for you animal lovers i am so sorry but actually shell of it is 100 percent deer skin i'm so sorry you animal lovers and the lining is 100 percent raylon raylon so anyway you know this is legit and on ebay I'll probably be able to fetch anywhere five to six to six fifty. I'll probably price that at. I am super, 
super pumped about that. I mean, it looks brand spanking new. And then up here, we have vineyard vines, but inside is not just the vineyard vine tie. We're talking Perielis two thin, slim ties with the what looks to be Georgetown Hoyas brand spanking new ties. Definitely going to be keeping the thin ones for sure. The Georgetown Hoyas one, we'll go ahead and give that away to somebody else. Now up top here, we have ourselves beautiful pairs of jeans. Again, with that pull-up little bottom here, all the trendy kids are rocking those these days. And then we have another pair. I believe these are J. Crew. Yep, J. Crew button-up fly. Same thing where they show a little bit of ankle on the bottom. You wear them with some boat shoes. All those hipster kids are rocking those. I think we will definitely be keeping those, ladies and gentlemen. Over here, we're coming over here to beautiful, beautiful, genuine leather. I'm talking full-blown, genuine leather. Great condition. Cole Hahn. Soft on the bottom. Not hard. Soft on the bottom. Cole Hahn. Don't know if those are my size yet, but that was an absolute fantastic grab. We have a Hermes tote bag, which I got up there on eBay for 75 free shipping. Hermes small tote bag coming over to a brand new Kate Spade pink credit card holder again brand new just put that on eBay has the little tag right there Kate Spade and we will be working on this whole entire pile here with a brand new zip up women's wallet purse Kate Spade that is the model number right there brand new we're going to be selling that on ebay of course coming down to orange blossom flower earrings 14k fill brand new with the bag pop that on ebay for 79 bucks right now another set we got to research these find out what these ones are beautiful earrings though very gorgeous i blessed the wife already so we do need to sell we can't hoard and keep everything just about to list this one on ebay long champ thin just zippered little pouch wallet with dust bag long champ those sell and we got some just generic johnnies i call these ones right here some family members might be getting these. Ostrich, again, just generic Johnny. But we're coming over here to a Hermes, a Hermes Paris wallet. That is what I'm talking about. Absolutely drop dead gorgeous. But unfortunately, guys, this one in particular, you're like, that's a find of a lifetime. Exactly. If it was real. And the reason why, unfortunately, just a hair of some of these are actually replicas. This is not that, I mean, it's a beautiful replica, but it's not that great of quality of replica. If you can see the top portion of the Hermes is like double stamped. Look at the M on the Hermes. It has a little extra on top, like they misstamped it. And unfortunately, the serial number, which I looked on other ones on eBay, is not tucked in the back. So, some family member, which probably is going to be Natalie, maybe for our anniversary, will get this. Anyway, absolutely gorgeous, though. I guarantee you it's the same material, but they just stamped it wrong. Also, some cleaning supplies. You always need some Swiffer and multi-purpose cleaner. Paul Frank Pajamas. We got Quicksilver board shorts. We got a ton of tennis shorts, workout shorts, Adidas. We got Adidas tennis shorts. We got Hurley shorts right there. We got a couple women's things. I'm going to wash and see if Natalie can fit into. Great, fantastic little action here. We have Nike Pro compression or leggings here for men. That is absolutely phenomenal. Love those. Going to use those for kickboxing. A ton of shorts. We're going to see what's going on with these. J. Crew. I think a couple Ralph Lauren's. Some khakis. Definitely some high-end shorts. Going to wash and see what's going on. These are actually Nike um, golf shorts here, I believe. And then we're coming over here to very short, uh, medium. I'm pretty sure this is a women's. Women's Laker jersey. Kobe Bryant, 8 we got a Lakers jersey. Now, this is probably the dude's medium. This <laughs> looks like some spilled something or other on the front right here. Other than that, a great jersey. That is Adidas. And we're going to come over here now, ladies and gentlemen, to the Michael Vick Falcons full-blown jersey. We're talking legitimate 
NFL champions. What is that? That's Equipment NFL Reebok Michael Vick. We got plenty more. Hold on. An Alvin Iverson medium jersey. Number seven, Ronaldo soccer jersey. No last name on the back, but an Adidas jersey. I'm pretty sure this is a German football club right there. Uh, Adidas jersey. Fantastic condition, by the way. And I'm probably going to sell this if it's not going for too much in the Jordan bundle. But this is NBA All-Stars 23 Hardwood Classics. This name brand is very expensive. Mitchell and Ness. That is a Jordan jersey. Great condition. Again, if this isn't going for that much um, or if it's going for medium price, I'll include it in the Jordan bundle. If it's going for $75.80 alone, obviously I will sell that separate. And I'm super excited about this. Pretty much, obviously, like, you know, the Jersey people are like, no way, no way. I'm more stoked in the Under Armour compression leggings for kickboxing. These are phenomenal. You know how much legit Under Armour compression leggings are? Very expensive. My size thrilled super thrilled thank you jesus and a tory birch snake skin tote with a clutch and i don't even know i'm gonna botch the name of this one but belinchilia paris motocross saddle bag with a mirror this bag i got up on ebay right now for 250 ladies and gentlemen oh yeah we're gonna throw the tory birch with the clutch up there combined with shipping eh, 125 those aren't going for that much money, the Tory Burches, but it's a beautiful, beautiful tote bag though. But we just don't really need that expensive of a tote bag to hide our Subway sandwiches, sneaking them into the movie theater. Oh, I didn't say that. I didn't say that. And a vintage Dior, Christian Dior clutch. Absolutely gorgeous. With a Valentino dust bag. I'm going to include that in the auction. We're going to price that at, I think, I think I'm going to go about 115 free shipping. So before I put it at the post office, ladies and gentlemen, that haul is getting even better. Just sold this used for 40 bucks. It's a Korean drama. All the discs are in there. And I just sold the Hermes small tote, which we will be dropping off at the post office. 40 bucks, Hermes for 75. Thank you, Jesus. It's been a great, great time, eBay. Oh, and I gotta post this Michael Vick jersey. I thought it was gonna be literally like a couple cents. They're going for about 25, 35 bucks. Did sell a Germany jersey because obviously World Cup is right now. Depends when you're watching this, but these were part of the designer purse haul right here. We got sealed, and this is the day after I went back sealed Wall Street two-pack, the original Wall Street, and the new one with Shia LaBeouf right there. I'm actually going to keep that. I like those movies right there. Oliver Stone did a great job with Wall Street. Money never sleeps. Okay, and then we got House of Cards season one. Well-written show, but it started to get kind of nasty, so we're over that one completely. Did watch a few episodes. Kids, stay away from it. Not really a good show, but very well-written. Just not clean. Whiplash, never seen it. Maybe I will see that and then sell it. Catching Fire, of course, I have seen that. That is brand new. Blu-ray, this one is not. Before I forget, I want to show you something we just grabbed tonight. I filmed it with a different camera, but there was a purse, an office chair, and like a table in the aisle way. My camera shut off because my memory card ran out of memory. Anyway, now I'm back on the Samsung S8+. Plus. This was inside the purse with two neckties for men. Let's go ahead and take a look at this real quick. I open it on up. A little bit of the tissue paper there. Look at that gorgeous necklace right there. That is absolutely phenomenal. And guess what? Ladies and gentlemen, my anniversary is coming up beginning July, July 4th. And so this is going to be a nice gift for the missus. You got to love free gifts. Thank you, Jesus.